Hey, what's going on, Scorpios? Uh, Butch Tarot here. Gonna do your one week read. Um, it's a general read, so it's not gonna resonate with everybody. Um, don't forget to refer to your charts, your sun, moon, rising, and your Venus. Um, if you haven't already, like and subscribe. Uh, always feel free to comment down below. And if you need to get a hold of me, um, all my information is in, it will be in the description or it's always in the about section of my YouTube channel. And uh, I get a lot of comments about people wanting to know what deck I'm using. Um, today I'm gonna use the Witch's Tarot. Um, it's a pretty good deck, I like it, it's colorful. So let's get right into it. Let's see what we have for you guys. What do we have for Scorpio? What is Scorpio? Scorpio. What's coming up for Scorpio next week? Alright, Scorpios. So the first thing I see is I get the Page of Cups. So I feel like there's something, um, I see that there's something like kind of resting. Um, there's a situation that kind of hasn't come to an end, it's still kind of sitting in limbo. Um, I feel like it's somebody from your past. Um, I feel like you took a little break from somebody, um, or they took a break from you. Um, you know, just to get get your stability in order. Um, you know, I feel like there hasn't been a lot of work going on. You know, you haven't been, been putting too much effort into this this person. Um, because, like I said, it's all or nothing here. It's They kind of took a break. Uh, they stepped away. Um, you know, I, I feel like there's still an opportunity there. I feel like the only reason they took a step a step away is because, like I said, they're trying to work on that stability. Um, I got the three of wands, so I feel like you've been kind of waiting for this person. This person, it hasn't come to an end. Um, you know, you've been patiently, you've been patiently waiting for this person. Uh, it, it, it's it's a matter of, you know, they kind of left you, like I said, in that limbo state. Um, they're they're working on something. Uh, with the King of Pentacles, um, you know, it might be some Taurus energy. We also got the King of Wands, so that's all. That could be a Leo energy. Um, I feel like you're not really sure if they are going to come back. I feel like, you know, it's kind of been a while now, and and you know they haven't come forward. You know, they took that break. Um, but I feel like you know, I feel like things are coming around for them, and I feel like it's still there. You're just not seeing it because there has been such a little gap here of of communication. Um, you know, I feel like it's 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 not completely over, and you know you're not seeing what's right in front of you because there hasn't been a whole lot of movement here. I feel like it's somebody from your past. It might not have been a relationship, but it might have been somebody that you wanted to be with. And like I said, they just kind of left you sitting in that limbo state with the page of cups. You know, you the offer was there. But nobody ever manifested it any further. Um, and I, like I said, I see that you haven't been putting a lot of work into this because it, it's a matter of they're not around. Um, you know, it, it's a matter of they're not, like I said, you're, you're, still, you're still waiting because you haven't given up on this person. Um, but I feel like it's, it's a matter of, you know, you've been patiently waiting but on the other hand, you haven't been given up, you know, moving forward. Because this person hasn't offered you anything. They haven't moved forward with this. It's somebody that you do want to be with. Um, but like I said, it, 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 it's right in front of you here. Um, it's a matter of they're not, they're not done with you either. I don't see that they're done with you. I feel like, they, like I said, I feel like they just want to work on that stability. Um, they want to offer you more. So I feel like they're, they're on, they're, they are still around and they're still working on it. 
Um, I feel like it is starting, like I said, with the Nine of Pentacles, I feel like it is starting to, you know, work out. Um, what they've been working on is, is gradually becoming what they wanted. And I do see them, I do see them reaching out to you. And I also got the, the Knight of Cups. So I, I, I feel like not only are they going to reach out to you, but they're going to come back and they're going to make that offer. Now they're, I feel like they're, they're ready now. In the next week, they're going to be ready. And they're going to reach out to you. And they're going to let you know that they're ready. Um, they just need to take a step back. Because I feel like this person, like like I said, with the King King of Pentacles, um, I'm getting some, I'm getting a, a Taurus energy. A, a Taurus energy. Um, and with Taurus, they, they love stability. They're all about stability. Um, you know, they want to be the one to be in control of their situation. And I feel like this person just needed that and needed to get control of that situation before they could come to you with a real genuine offer or before they could accept any offer that was given. Um, they might have some Leo, you know, energy as well. So what that tells me is that not only they want that stability, but their pride is involved in this as well. Um, they pride themselves on being stable, st stable, and they pride themselves on on bringing stability to any relationship that they're in. And like I said, I feel like they were just kind of taking a break. Um, I feel like it's somebody, like I said, with somebody from your past. It is somebody that's um, you know been around for a while in your life. Uh, you know, somebody that you had feelings for, and still do. And like I said, you've been waiting. You know, they haven't made much effort to, you know, progress this anyway. But you're not seeing what's right in front of you. What's right in front of you is they're not progressing because they weren't ready. It wasn't because they didn't have feelings for you. Because I see that they do have feelings for you. Um, you know, they do They do have a lot of feelings for you. But like I said, it, it was a matter of they just needed to get their situation in check. Um, I do see them coming. You know, I do, like I said, I with the Knight of Cups, I do see them... They do have love for you, and they are going to manifest that love. Um, and with the Eight of Wands, I feel like they are going to reach out in the next week here. Um, so, I mean, your patience is paying off. And like I said, you weren't putting in the work because you weren't seeing anything back from them. But, you know, the feelings are still there. Like, you can try to you try to hide the feelings because, like I said, there was no forward movement. And this, per this doesn't seem like it was going anywhere. So you felt like, almost like... It, they weren't giving you nothing. They weren't giving you what you wanted. So you you manifested that into a, into the thought process that they weren't interested. Um, but the cards are telling me the opposite. I feel like they are interested. Um, like I said, they were working on that stability. Uh, the Nine of Pentacles. I feel like you know that's everything's starting to work out that way. And now they're starting to feel more confident. And I feel like they will reach out to you. And like I said, I don't I don't feel like. I don't feel like, um, I, I, right now you don't understand, like, you're not understanding why they didn't move forward with that, um, but I got the lover's card for clarification here, so not only do I feel like they do have strong feelings for you, um, they're, they're, they're very attracted to you, we got some Gemini energy here, uh, with the lover's card as well, so I feel like not only do they have feelings for you, but they have really strong feelings for you. I feel like they see you as a soulmate connection, and that's why they want to build that stability for you guys to move forward. Um, and sometimes people shut uh, shut people that they care about out while they're working on something because they got to put all their energy in, into what they're doing, and I feel like this is what they were doing. Um, and I feel like, like I said, you were, you, you were in the back of your mind, you, you know, you've given up, you stopped putting that work in with the 10 of... Uh, ten of Ten of Wands in reverse. You stopped putting that work in because you weren't getting anything back from them. Um, but you were still waiting. You know, you were being patient and you were waiting. You know, uh, you haven't given up on, on this person. And I feel like the reason that you haven't, you're into, you haven't given up on this person because your intuition told you that there is a strong connection here. You just didn't think they seen it. But I'm, I'm here to say that from what I see in these cards, it's telling me that, that not only do they feel the same way, um... But it was a matter of they wanted to build something for you. In, in order for you guys to move forward, you need that stable, um, you know, that stability. And I feel like that, you know, this person, like I said, you could be dealing with Taurus or an Earth energy. 
Um, they could have a little bit of fire in their in their charts as well. Um, but like I said, it was all about pride. They they, they want to be um, dependable for you, and they want to build that stability. And in order to do that, they had to you know dive right into it. But I feel like they are coming back. I feel like they are going to reach out. Um, you know, they are going to move forward with 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 you know they do want to move forward with getting with you. Um, and we got the lovers card as well. So I do see they they do see as a soulmate connection. I feel like you've already felt that as well. Um, so my advice to you is just know that this person is still there. Um, they're just waiting to come back. Like I said, they were working on some things, um, but it was a matter of they wanted to build that stability. It wasn't a matter of they weren't interested anymore because I feel like they are still very interested. Um, they always were interested. They just didn't want to come to you empty handed. Um, and that's what I got for you, Scorpio. So don't forget to listen to your intuition. And like I said, I feel like you already know that you had a strong connection with this person and they feel the same for you. Um, so that's what I got for you for the next week. Thanks for watching.